A development fight is really riling up residents in one southwest Miami-Dade neighborhood. A longtime landmark marketplace is being sold, and the developer plans to build an assisted living facility on that very site. Local tenants Leanne Morihong is live with more on this. I used to live by that place, and I used to love those strawberry shakes there. They were delicious, and I'm pretty upset about this myself, Leanne. Go ahead. Yeah, you know, everyone that lives in this community, they know Norman Brothers. It's been a name in South Florida for decades, known for their fresh produce. Their owners, though, they say they're ready to hang it up. They're going to be selling in the very near future. But a lot of the neighbors in this area immediately surrounding the market, they have some concerns. They're watching very closely because a developer is planning to put an elder care facility and they're eyeing the property. A staple of Southwest Miami-Dade will soon be no more. The owners of Norman Brothers Produce say they're ready to move on. We are getting older. Our next generation has got, moved on to other things. We don't have anybody coming up in the ranks who wants to take over Norman Brothers. And uh, the president of our company and his wife are going to be 81 this year. And it seemed like time. Sue Ann Suggs is the general manager at Norman Brothers. She says customers have been sad but supportive about their decision to sell. They, they've become friends and supporters of ours, and uh, they're sad to see us go. Norman Brothers is a staple for this community, and we love it. Mary Feraldo lives nearby and says she's paying close attention to the proposed elder care facility slated to be built in its place. We don't want towering buildings here. It, it's, it's not compatible and it's not consistent with the area's zoning. The build would require rezoning, a request that was approved Wednesday with some conditions attached. They've come in with a reasonable uh, concession from 36 feet, three stories. They've come down to a solid two-story building, which we agree with. Um, but now there's, there's a few things that we're still... Um, that we're still not completely happy about, but I do believe the builder when he said we want to work with you. Yeah, Miami-Dade Commissioner Raquel Regalado made it a point to tell the developers that they need to work with the concerned residents in this area to make sure that their concerns are addressed. As for when we will see the end of Norman Brothers, the general manager we spoke to said it's not happening tomorrow. You still have some time left. The employees here, as well as those frequent customers, uh, Sue Ann Suggs telling us that they'll get at least a couple of months notice before that sale is final. Reporting live oh. here in Southwest Miami-Dade, I'm Leanne Morejon, Local 10 News.